Now this mass migration due to industrialization in Europe uh, and started even in America. The machine tool came into the picture. Many things, many aspects to that. So when car and other like you no, know, motor driven kind of thing, there is a new opportunity for people to work in various fields. In various industries. Actual growth and development took place many times. So in this time now, in, I'm coming back to India. What had happened in India? The great minds, great intellectuals, wherever they have found, they have switched over, switched over for their job, for their security here. If you take the common society, it is not everywhere you will find hundred percent intellectual. There are. non intellectuals also there are also people with no qualification some are skill labor skill workers for their survival point of view they have moved out and they felt wherever they can work for a company or work for an industry work for an organization in the honest way so that they earn a little bit money for their family they can support any people work as a migration like you no know, worker like in canada what is happening or all this arabian world from india they are migrating and that the harsh condition the indian people are can be adapted anywhere that is what and they are hard working people they are hard working people uh not in their own motherland the outside i will i'm not <laughs> trying to tell over here the people in their own country or state they don't to work they feel the urgency of work i do not know why this is happening i have rambo observed many states by like, you know, bengal bihar odisha kerala Uh, many many friends I have I have a discussion with them why this is happening. Only one thing is there, like you no, know, they feel that what society is going to tell that if you work something after having your qualification, it is better to move out and do whatever you want to do. People are going not to be recognized or people don't ask any question, so you can work in any level, whatever work you get, it you do it. nobody is watching you hey, only the people are watching it is their respective countries people are watching you you want to avoid that part that is what the societal thing is the picture look i have i've told many times many videos you no know, what is good or bad you only think how you see it like you no know, what kind of persuasion so you how, how much you can push your journey in that direction that is more important here in terms of migration many people have migrated i have told you from moved out from bengal to different state went to settle down there are few nobel laureates also originate from bengal they have settled down and now they are doing the intellectualism and all those things i talked in many videos i am not referring that one every time referring the bengal intellectuals i have published 6 7 8 8 videos uh, and it's a long subject specifically the economics come in the economic science i told you are not uh, nobel laureate but rodriguez the doctor amar hussain and what kind of propagation theories is proposing like no leading to government and to talk free bees and many things like no allowing people to get into the system i have talked in many videos one can refer my videos for that purpose what happened to other states other states also the same thing whoever the creamy people clean clean students they have either settled in india or doing something or getting into government job there is even though there is no much more scope in government sector now the question is here we have to create an opportunity and within our limited resources when we have seen the heritage and background like you know how we have been attacked by different invaders including the moguls now we can understand india is a very wealthy country many things are there you have such a fantastic weather conditions i have been talking to my friend that i have visited finland and in finland there is no crow 
for that matter many animals you won't find many animals over there the reason is simple because of the temperature is goes up to minus 20 25 degree temperature in the winter season and you have 18 to 20 hours only dark then day you won't be able to understand whether it is in the night or day so there are many issues that's why this living animals and all you will find uh, mostly in the temperate uh, regions the crow is a very interesting bird one can see one can note few points over here here in they can be used for our defense purpose their mechanism their behavioral pattern i have studied their patience many things i have studied it can be totally totally replicated i can correlate the kind of penetration or understanding they have to pick up collectively this chicken or the foods it can be compared with america when they have tried with bin laden how they dig down bin laden that story is known to everybody in the night but this is happening in daylight picking up chicken pieces again i am not describing wow this american they have done and taken out bin laden from abbottabad and all that i'm telling same thing they dig out from me yeah the dam portion there are many heads that is been taken friends what i am trying to tell over here if the bird's behavior is been used for the defense or kind of a security system one can think of even they are identifying the different objects modules their clear vision clear movement and very tactical way of handling things without getting into more conflict you can correlate with chanakyoniki they are not the crow the great sea crow chanakko crow that is what it is not present in that idiot prashant kishor that is what i want to say we can talk about i have seen again i am little debating taking little maybe one minute people are giving lot of importance to prashant kishor let me tell you summarize this fellow in two sentences and idiot fellow is spoiled in the indian society and he is getting his intellectual satisfaction by using this full political system and he is making his roti is earning be careful about whoever is listening be careful about this fellow prashant kishor people who talk about this gentleman as a chanakya he is not 0.0000000001% of chanakya i can tell you this much i have nothing to say about if prashant kishor is listening probably now you can decide whether you want to continue this profession if you have the sense of understanding of the development and the your motherland i think you are qualified want to understand that but don't do the bad politics don't play with the common people give good advice nothing wrong giving good advice to government for the better man but just to get hold don't do this dirty gaming i know is written what you have done recently in bengal says uh, what i am trying to say within the society democratic society what are their bad element good elements are there one has to recognize simply telling somebody great and brilliant this things are not good you have to see that what kind of what are doing and for that purpose you are telling good or bad my fourth submission is uh, crows as i have told it living across the globe except the extreme low temperature region you will find everywhere millions of crows in the caravan starting from america the entire america your africa arabian world asian countries wherever you see that crows crows are everywhere crows are there in our heart also but that in our crows has to be raised and canalized in a positive manner that is what i was trying to tell you 
Soldiers very much democratic in nature and the collective consciousness they do it. We also can equally raise our collective consciousness in a positive direction. That is what I want to feel. And one can do a lot of research and even trivial studies on cat. I am requesting government of India or your conservation department, whoever, start a new program on cat behavioral studies that is going to open up many things and you can also make good technologies from the behavioral pattern of cat, uh, sorry, the pros, that is what I want to tell over here. The fifth point, their adaptive condition, they can live in a harsh condition, food without food or many things like they can uh, fly first, attack first, collaborate first. In perfect society, probably one can make a note that how to learn from the crow rather than telling crows are the bad bird, bird something. I think they are the first municipal, three of Kostafai Karmachari, they are doing even not even without paid, it is that they know. Cats, uh, crow's population also is getting reduced day by day, I can see their problem, they are not allowed to sit any place near to your home only trees the trees numbers are going down so that cats populations also uh, rose populations also is getting reduced so we need to take care of both angles friends uh, i've been speaking for a long time the reason behind these are all camera fitted and I'm trying to see whether uh, is there any possibilities through is coming again because now time is also very important once they find already people are there the kittens are there they try to avoid it here one has to learn things that the mental status like uh, uh, in your personal life also if you see that something is going bad it is better to be silent than to be silent in case of nation what is happening that you know it's a fit for that kind of thing also situation has to be created by realizing the situation how much it is not every time you feel the situation is very dangerous for that matter you have to put your all army and everything now you see this is simply incident what is happening now in a basically defense also you can use this idea for different application and some mathematical problem can be solved cats is a good, great mind now <clears throat> scientist also is trying to understand cat's mind because it's a small brain and doing multiple work and they're the most intelligent parts crows 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 is black and beautiful is a black and beautiful that is what i want to tell over here so, so the many concepts can be developed and giving little importance to people who are very black in nature but one is to start think of their hard working mind many things that have to be respected friends uh, this crow is probably won't be able to come even though i have some foods over here because they have a deeper sense of understanding analyzing the timings that how many times three or four times this crow came and he went out he has seen there is a human movement some cats movement here and there so it probably they're also worried about their life very much i have many videos to show that if you stand and uh, they see a group of crows they will use a kind of certain kind of uh, sound that comes sound very peculiar i have seen it for cats also for rats also, those things are very kind of, they use their different vocal cord, they use it either they do meh or meh or meh or similar way you can find out for crows, uh, they can use their vocal cord in a different way to convey this message i have observed this crow what they do they come to this particular grill they see if they found things are fine they single-handedly does this job and went back if they found the situation is very critical they try to raise his voice like 
So his own voice, what you say, so because I am not able to uh, mimic those things. But the changing scale, like now in high pitch, you call other than immediately trying to want to climb up and come. that I am not able to do it, I need support. That is what the collective responsibility is coming into the picture for execution. Friends, I was talking about the crows. Uh, my observation for many years on crows, uh, finally it's boiling down to a few points probably. The Marai crows are very, very intelligent species and they are very much patient you wait and watch everything very carefully there each movement is very measured and calculated even though we feel that we are sometimes annoyed with their noise and all those things maybe it might be bothering many people uh, but uh, they are doing the right job in nature and they should the early morning they get up the habit of Five o'clock, they will get up and try to um, make a gathering and make a noise. They have the deep concept of society. One crow doesn't fight with another crow, but they will fight with another bird. That is another important lesson. They exercise their full biological skills with full power and energy very collectively. And their brain is very mature one. They take the decision. Once they target certain things, they try to fulfill it. Whichever way, they will find the opportunity. They are the greatest salesman, like marketing man, intelligent man. I think they are the greatest mind among all bars. Very scientific research for their behavioral studies. We human wants to learn from the nature. I've been telling the nature is having a lot of things. Millions of birds, millions of animals, they are surviving and they have their own struggle and journey and the survival mechanism. Another point why I want to make, they don't think for tomorrow. They live in instant moments, time, that is what it is more important. Once you understand this philosophy, the philosophy of Mayabad also you'll understand that we humans are the part of Mayabad. Crows are not Mayabadis. They are very practical, they are very rational thinkers where the idea of oil distribution is coming into the picture when uh, a crow gets any rat or any prey. They don't eat alone, they share it. You can find this concept of socialism or democracy, nice democracy if you want to imagine so you want to use the cats, uh, cat and as well as uh, rat as well as crows model. Friends, I've been speaking, I've been speaking for long time, many issues because I could visualize uh, uh, this is a high time for us to think of different dimensions like you know, understanding the nature, understanding the animal behavior, how they work, how they react, the timings, the get up, different animal comes out on street roads and uh, their prey in different times. Prey that has to be alive. Like in our education system also many things probably those can be taken taken into consideration like the knowledge part I'm talking about for the kids. For the development of <coughs> character. <coughs> Friends, the crows are part of civilization like human being there. Closely associated uh, with the humans also, like uh, the human being, uh, like <coughs> like dogs and <coughs> sorry, cats also. Same way, they, they pursue a different way, they are also part of the society. So it's a high time for us to do, carry out and understand the uh, analytical way to understand the crows, their minds and mentality that this can be used for our 
<coughs> understanding the society or not, that is the point what I can say. We have many things to learn from the bars. Only thing you have to change your mind frame whether to learn something or not, that is either the individual choice, collective choice or country choice. I talked about many times, if you want to have a good economy, a prosperity, you have to address the common goal, basic goal, whatever resources you have to channelize it at proper direction. That is direction must come from the society, individual contribution, that there must be some rules and regulation to implement those rules and one should make sure it is followed up or not. Only speaking, speaking it doesn't help, you need to have courage and to take a decision, maybe not one or two decision to one idea can be taken into consideration like you know, if you are proposing something better man, you need to see whatever the best possible way to do that. Only talking is not going to help. Talking is going to not help because finally in ground line, line you need millions of people to execute those things and you need to change the mentality also. If I take the crow's mind and also human mind, it cannot be compared. <coughs> it cannot be compared at all. Fred's crows are much more generous. Uh, if you think of human, human are self-centric, individualistic. Individually, they want to explore many things. That is what. That's why for the leadership, what I'm trying to tell over here, for human, they want to rule a uh, kind of thing in nature. Uh, it has been dis decided. I talked about... If you analyze 5,000 years of history of the civilization, the human civilization, your monarchy, Jomindar system, it was taking more share than the democracy. Democracy has come 19th century or this 20th century, whichever you say it. But before that, kings. Instead of wealth capturing, uh, accumulating, then ruling, that mentality was there. Similar way in a society, you need to see in human society, <coughs> similar kind of model, parallel model for understanding one can draw or not. I'm pretty sure it is possible to draw a similar kind of line and understanding, taking crows, rats and cats in mind. I feel they're very kind of a social, even though they have the fights, those fights are not to be taken very seriously, but in case of human, this aggression deprives something to the common people. It is all deliberate, deliberate way it has been done. Because our society is total, totally mechanism. I told my previous videos that if you consider the world's uh, um, the living world, our human share is below 1%, rest 99% is your plants, animals, small bird and insect, algae, all those things, marine life, if you consider, those are taking close to 99%. But in your ecological pyramid, if you see, humans are sitting on top and trying to control everything. And this is, I feel, against the concept of equilibrium. Friends, uh, many things to talk about, many issues to be discussed. Until or unless we are convinced uh, by certain fundamentals in life and certain fundamentals, the nature, the way things they are doing by themselves, then probably it will be easier for a society, human society like us. Again, the, whether those to be executed or not, it is not my concern, at least for understanding purpose, it is very important to know all those things, so that you gradually change yourself a little bit, and, or if one is finding any relevance properly, this change in your own mind and attitude, that is what is more important. Your leadership quality, pursuance of certain things, your interest to pursue certain things, full-heartedly that is more important it is not you do certain things and halfway you 
get frustrated and you come back. Probably one has to learn from this animal world how they nurture their kids with adverse conditions. Various other factors are involved. What every time I say, nature is a complex thing, and if you consider these birds and animals, plants, they are the part of nature. Probably they have also equal right to survive, equal right to produce, equal right to have food. If you deny or anybody is denying or if they are not getting access to such kind of things, sometimes they do the silent protest also. The silent protest in the different forms, so that has to be again understood. If two cats are fighting or two rats are fighting or two rat or cat or any other animals are fighting, means there is a scarcity of many things. It can be of biological need, it can be of food and shelter, many other things. I have more deeper video which in analysis, love and understanding of a kitten, how they treat their own human friend and this video I am going to maybe releasing today. I have already taken up because I do not have time. Whatever things I am speaking, it is sometimes sitting in front of toilet, sitting, going and walking, I am doing it. I don't spend much more time on those energy. Only thing I am speaking, my mind, I only concentrate few things, probably what I am going to speak. I don't refer many books or journals for that matter. My purpose of making all those videos to make it simple to understand your life and others' life. Whole holistic way of understanding all those things. So that you can improve upon yourself, whether you can improve little bit and what the animal world doing, getting up early morning, doing many jobs, many work, whether we can do it or not. I was just talking about our education system. Even I was thinking to propose, I have my vision document now, I'll be taking uh, vision documents for my Bengal, I'll project it. How you can make it is a sustainable education system where you don't ask money from the government. I have my own plan in my mind. If it has been applied, I am 100% sure with the capacity of 400, 500 students where you need 10 or 12, 15 teachers to teach them. Your salary can be generated self way by using the same infrastructure and facilities by doing small, small things. That I am going to propose and I am not discussing over here. Friends, once you can thank you very much. I have started with Crow and uh, uh, ending with Crow, that is a happy note. Crow is bella, very black in nature. So there is a nice song, Krishna Koli Amitare Goli, Kalo Tare Jare Goli Gaer Luke. Kalo shi jatoi kalo khok, dekhe chitar kalo harin chok. Yes, you are romanticizing somebody, but Rabindranath has not got the idea of romanticizing nature, the crows. He is talking and I am repeating, Krishna koli ami tarei boli, kalo tarei jale jato bale gaer lok. Kalo se jatoi kalo hog, dekhe sitar, kalo harin chok. It turns I do not have the script. I might be not telling exactly one or two or I am putting from my side. Never mind. But in nature the crows, the beauty of crows and their intelligence, beauty plus intelligence. Like if here if I compare peacock and crow, I'll give much more marks to crows than peacock. Peacock has got the beauty, the ability, their color, their safe size is very fantastic. But if you think of their brain, you can give, if you give, let's say for crow their brain 80 to 90 percent, I'll give you peacock even not more than 10 percent here is coming the beauty and brain i'll talk separately what is beauty in your way what is actual beauty is all about 
that has to be understood if that is understood probably you don't need a miss universe or miss world some kind of thing friend again i am diverting from this topic because many things are coming in my mind i am releasing one by one and trying to put into the video so that if anybody is reading probably with their clarity they can think and they can question also there is absolutely no problem our most of the society everything has been created and decided artificially probably taken from various input either it is in the case of food in the case of your defense it can of your shelter i have not told about a very beautiful thing about the crow the way they make the nest with taking everything into consideration picking up very selective things making their nest how many and they make it is a very good structure so that it lasts for longer lasts for their generations see what a crow we might be thinking while making the nest you see they are bringing iron rods bringing cellulosic material bringing mud sometime they make their nest such a beautiful and fantastic way the sticks from the dried plants and all they make it make it in a little high places so that there is no access to any kind of prey they are coming or attacking them how wonderful this is probably one has to see it we sometimes we see many things in nature we simply ignore them that's why every time i say your analytical power is important how deeply and great way you are analyzing friends whatever i am speaking i have little understanding what is going on globally because if i read and refer probably it will be i'll try to take the same path that's why i use my rational thinking and understanding out i have never ever studied the crow probably not searching any literature or any that i'm speaking that with my rational thinking what i'm going to talk about the diet Uh, what uh, talk about the crows and trying to see observing their behavioral pattern those things that i have been speaking this is got a real relevance i feel at the end of the day friends i have a few more seconds left probably i want to thank everybody that i could able to do this thing the small message if anybody is watching probably they can share their thoughts because they are also watching the animal world i want to enrich my knowledge to see that things what are the things happening in nature we can pick up many things and if you can utilize it if an individual or a country for that matter the group their living standard can be elevated their mental standard can be elevated and their education and other things can be also part of this knowledge and understanding skills in of the crows rats and cats friends i think i have covered up everything i want to thank and to everybody it is not i am giving my time energy not to fulfill my intellectual satisfaction in the end of the day i think everybody be aware about the fact that what are the things happening and i am only sharing this information i do not have anybody if anybody is not interested to listen to what i am speaking it's their choice no problem i do not have any problem i do not have any problem from from my side also this is my own idea and understanding if i am not speaking then who is going to speak that is what it is society the people who are ruling the country i made many videos i question their credibility over here even if they do not have the idea they can always borrow, borrow those ideas or different places our constitution has also written by borrowing different countries democracy man like baba shah ambedkar could do it why not us have consultancy good consultancy of different industry have open mind otherwise will be a kind of a mediocre things mediocre level thinking making memes and all doing all kind of frustration giving frustration it has got no end 
look here the chief minister or prime minister for that matter whoever the leaders they are there to see thank you very much